Hello Aquarius, this is your July 2018 reading. It will not resonate with all Aquarius people. I know last month you all went through a bit of a ringer, but you're, eventually you're going to have happiness if you wait for it. It may take a while, but you will have your happiness if all the Aquarians that were there last month join me this month. Let's find out what's going on. It may resonate with you this time again. It may not. July 2018 Aquarius. General reading. Aquarius, July 2018. Aquarius, July 2018. I'm hoping that positive things happen in Aquarius because you've got to realize that Mars is going through your sign. Those who are cross-watching realize that Mars is going through their sign, so it'll have different reactions. One, um, they'll be argumentative. You'll be more argumentative. People around you will be. Um, other, other things that could happen is that you may work more. Uh, you may want to work more. More work will come to you. Um, another thing that could happen is uh, maybe... Some of you will be playing a lot of sports, trying to get your energies out. If not, you should, maybe. And also, maybe you just be, you know, enjoying yourself with a little recreational fun with the opposite sex. Or, you know, whatever, you know, you're into that at the time, you know. But I'm hoping good things for Aquarius. Four Wands, in reverse, beginning overall energy. You're not feeling real super happy right now. It's the Four of Wands. It's contentment, happiness, like the happy home. Let's see. Could be over the Prince of Cups. You got that as the, um, how can I say it, the subject at hand. Could be the current environment. We've got to find out what's crossing. That could be a water sign or someone just taking on an energy. It'd be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, not in that order. Why are you there? Prince of Cups for Aquarius. Maybe you're taking on that energy, but I'm thinking for a lot of you, this is somebody else. Prince of Cups, why are you there? Why are you Let's. Let, I need a crossing card. A crossing Ugh, card. Mm, strength. Maybe this person has helped you regain strength. It also could be someone who's taxing your strength because it is crossing you. But these are both I consider positives for some reason. I'm feeling that for some of you. Uh, oh, the, 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 the goal. The goal for Aquarius. What is your goal? Prince of Disc in reverse. That could be an earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. They're in reverse, so maybe you're trying to reach out this person in reverse or trying to settle something somehow. I'll find out later. I'm going to, re I'm going to clarify these cards. Foundation. Why is the foundation for, what, what is the foundation for Aquarius, I should say? You're not moving on from a certain situation. You got the Eight of Swords. It's in reverse, so you haven't moved on in the past. What happened in the past with Aquarius? You you, could, you, were, you felt failure. Seven of Pentacles. This is someone contemplating on something that didn't work out and trying to figure out how to go about making it work. So there was a failed situation you're trying to rectify in the past. In the near future, you don't get quite a, in the near future. This is like the next few days, and it's it's a fast energy. You, you're going to feel like you don't have the victory in the next few days, the first few days of uh, July, especially. Maybe you feel a little depleted. I'm going to put the last four cards out because I want to clarify these first. what the overall energy is. You know what the weirdest part is? The overall energy is still the same. Four ones in the reverse as, as it came out. That's strange. Prince of Cups and the Strength card. Why you the current conditions, environment, the subject. Making a decision what to do. 
This is when you got two different things in front of you. One is better than the other, but you don't want to let go either one in case the good part doesn't work out. You still got that one that you kind of don't want. Maybe that you have two people, two si different situations, and you're holding on to both. But eventually, you're going to have to let go of one. Could have a lot to do with that water sign. Why is the Prince of Disc your goal in reverse? That's the one I wanted to say. Walking away, you may be walking away from the Prince of Disc. That may be your goal. Six of Swords in reverse is the foundation. It's in reverse. I'm seeing you wanting to walk away from the Prince of Disc, but currently you're not, you haven't done that. You want to become. You want to come out of feeling chained. Got that for somebody else too. Seven of Pentacles. Why are you in the past? Why was there a failure in the past? There it is again. Seven of Pentacles. There was a definite failure in the past. Okay. Six of Wands in the very near future. You want to come out of feeling trapped. You don't feel like you had a victory and you want to come out and feel trapped in the next few days. I need another card for that. Why is the uh, Six of Wands in reverse with the Eight of Swords clarifying it, crossing it, or clarifying it in reverse? Why is it there? Yeah, because of deceptions and secrets and lies. What is coming towards you or the Advice card? Ace of Wands. The advice could be not to, you know, all for a new passionate beginning right now. That could be the advice. Let's find out. Ace of Wands, why are you there? Communications. Be careful of what you offer somebody because communications, you may want to call somebody or offer somebody something. It's the Ace of Wands. You may be uh, saying it wrong, so be careful of your words. We do have a Mercury retrograde coming up in July. That's when we get miscommunication, so be careful of that. What is coming towards you or what people are thinking is the hangman in reverse. They're seeing someone, uh, I think that people are seeing you not waiting not hanging around, and they think maybe you should just slow down, possibly. Or, may, you know, it could be that somebody who was also, because it's the outside environment, it could be that somebody was hanging in the balance in the past and is no longer hanging in the balances anymore. They're coming out. Let's find out, though. We don't know. The hangman, why are you in reverse for Aquarius? Why are you in reverse for Aquarius? Yeah, someone may be coming out of the woodwork and they got a wish to talk to you. And maybe they're bringing good wishes towards you. Because remember, this is the outside environment coming towards you. Could be what people are thinking, like I said. And they may be wanting to offer you something of a wish, something you'll like. Hopes and fears. Sneaky behavior in reverse. Maybe you're just wanting, putting something to rest. Maybe you're afraid of sneaky behavior coming out. It could be that you're afraid that someone used sneaky behavior against you. Seven of Swords, why are you there? Two of Pentacles, someone dropping something, someone no longer working on something. I need another card for that. Got a couple of cards. Ace of Pentacles. Page of Cups. I'm seeing like somebody wanting offers too. Hmm. Let's look at this. Got the Seven of Swords reverse. That's coming out of someone no longer wanting something sneaky around. So that could be your hope. Maybe you're dropping a situation with the Two of Pentacles in reverse. Maybe you're wanting to make a stable offer to somebody, a possibly of love, or, or you're, you're hoping that for yourself, someone coming towards you to do it. And someone may, like I said, may do it, okay? But let's find out. The outcome, you got success again. Aquarius, it is coming. In the near, fu in, in, in the near future, you, you're feeling like you didn't get a victory, but you are going to get success in the end. You, you went through something. A lot of your signs did. You went through a failed situation. And you're, you're thinking about walking away. 
And you want to offer a passion new beginning, but be careful how you offer it. Maybe slow down a little. Don't don't be so quick to make that offer straight out. Let you know. Just go with the motions. I'm feeling, but you are getting success. Let's find out why. Let's rock the boat here. Six of Pentacles. It's a slow success, but it's coming. Why are you there? Six of Pentacles for Aquarius. As someone still feeling like a little sorrowful, though, you're not seeing the Two of Cups that's behind you. You got success, but you, it's like something broke your heart. Um, yeah, you're getting happiness, too. Something broke your heart. You're still clinging to that past situation. Even though success and sunshine is coming your way, part of you is still left in, your, in the past. Part of that your heart is somewhere else still, Aquarius. And um, one more card. One more card for Aquarius with the success. I like to rock the boat. Make it interesting. I'm thinking you're taking on the King of Pentacles energy. Now this also could be a King of Pentacles is in the end. That someone sounds stable, um, good character, you know, Handsomely attractive, either way, female or male, they're there. But you may have success, but part of you, like I said, you remember there's three of cups that are spilled. Try not to. Oh, and you got the ace of swords. You're gonna you're still gonna, you know, you're not gonna hold back. You're gonna say what you want wanna say. Never known Aquarius to hold back their words. It's in the upright. You're going to say what you need to say, and you're going to do it right. But just be careful how you communicate, because sometimes Aquarius people come off a little rough. Okay? So, success is on your way. Happiness. Let the spilt cups of, of sorrow go. Don't worry about things that you cannot change. Try to improve everything. And that is your reading, Aquarius. I will let you go. Probably be back in the middle of July. Hopefully things are going well. Don't worry about the past so much, okay? Just go forward. Bye.